I thought it was actually some gossip about Cowgirl Up, a Telefilms production. Because um, I'm on set here with Mary Beth. <laughs> Hiya! Hiya! Well, this isn't really set, I guess. Um, it's kind of like we the kitchen. Well, I think there will be potential shoots maybe at this kitchen table, but none have happened yet. We're you, breaking it in right now. <laughs> you are, however, in costume. I, I am. I think, I think we're going to decide, but this is um, my pajama wear for day night of plotting against the, the red team. rama I didn't do this because I'm weird. There was a giant <laughs> bug. bug. The gnats are very attracted to Nicole today. Yeah, they in all her love interviews. me. They want to steal FaceTime from me, is what's happening That's exactly in this right. interview. It, you know, they already have. Look, all we're talking about is gnats. I want to talk about the bitches <laughs> on the shoot. The bitches on the shoot. <laughs> so how's it, how's it been for you since you started Cowgirl Up? You having fun? I'm having a great some, time. Doing some things that you haven't done before. Oh my God! New so ground, new I I have ridden a horse in with uh, with giving the horse direction for the first time ever in my life. Wild horses. Oh. That's all I know. That's all. What um, kind of directions did you give it? <laughs> Call me, um, let's do lunch, and can you get me an agent? <laughs> Where it was really the directions I gave it. We'll and? see if it comes through. We'll see if it comes okay, through. Okay, that's good. That's it was good. a lovely horse named Lily. Um, hopefully she's connected to the industry. We'll see. <laughs> we purposely gave you that one. She takes directions very well. Yeah, right? Yeah. And, and I've lassoed. I've lassoed haystacks with um, steer heads on it. Come on, sheep. What do you got, sheep? What do you got? Whoa! Check it out! Nice job! Hell to the yes, y'all! Okay, you okay. didn't know what hit you. You didn't know what hit you. Okay, I gotta no go. match. Go. No match. I've shot a gun for the first time. It's crazy. Like wore like chaps. I've never worn chaps. Wore chaps for the first time on this shoot. Um, are you going to buy some chaps when you get home, you think? Do you like love them a lot? I, I, as long as I'm in air conditioned areas <laughs> and it doesn't require any work wearing them. If it's strictly for fun and pleasure, <laughs> use your imagination. I'm game. Oh, people already are. I will, uh, I will get some. Would you like me to have some? Yeah. Why are you well, flirting with me? I feel like me? I can't help it. <laughs> Wow. Um, I love this now, I, now I'm nervous. Now I'm turning red. Now this is you are blushing. She's totally blushing. Oh my god, you have a crush on me. I do. So she has a crush on me. So um, I happen to really like your character in the show. Thank I think you. It's very funny. Um, how do you feel about being British on Dude Ranch? On a Dude Ranch. It was, uh, right? Like total um, contrasting. Uh, accent and activities, which is awesome for the character because it's totally um, not up her alley to do any of the stuff, but she's very competitive and um, it's fun. I love bitchy Brits. Who doesn't? Who doesn't? Everybody's got a red hold. lipstick. I'm yeah. rocking. It's good time. It does take you an oddly long time to put on your red lipstick. <laughs> I Everybody. always feel like every time I see Maya, she's putting on your face. Just, it's like know. we've held up product. We've we've had to drop scenes for my lipstick. <laughs> oh my God, Kristen's like, yes, we have. It's Literally, true. it's taken forever. But I yeah. think it's like the stain and the liner and getting the line right. I I don't wear red lipstick on a on a frequent basis. Do you? Do you wear lip liner? Do you want me to wear red lipstick on a frequent basis? That's what I want to know. No. Uh, sure. Only if you want to. Wow. Do you want to go to dinner? Oh my God, she's asking me. Maybe. You live in Chicago. Oh, no, I totally would, but you live in Chicago. Oh, I totally shut, would. You live in Chicago. Shut down. That's what I just got shut down. <laughs> First, gu I have gun training now, um, so I can shoot people down well. <laughs> your gun's kind of obnoxiously long. Oh. Don't you feel like that's true? I thought that was like a euphemism for something. Oh, no, like, that's actually like your literal, literal gun. gun. Yeah. Yes, You're I have, I, I am packing a lot of heat. All right. You want to talk about my gun? Yeah. All right, take too much of it. You know what they say about Either a lady guy. Let's roll, please. <laughs> with a big gun? From, from uh, okay, ready, on your mark. Do you, you got to go? No. Because okay. I don't either, so all if right, you right, find right, out right. somebody, just let me know. Because I'd really like to know what they say. And I, I, but I think again, it's a great choice for the character, right? To have a ridiculously for sure, long gun for sure. For um, someone who doesn't know how to use it, it's good. Do you want this canteen over there? Since
Nice shot, baby. I love you. With a gun? Uh, I can't really see her. Oh, okay. Okay. She was in the front, mine's in the back. Oh, yeah. so it's a right, she was in the front. It's all about the what? Yeah. It's all about the what? The bit. It's all about the bit. Anything for the bit. Anything for the laugh. Very All right, sad. Uh, so the chap situation, we, we are on a horse ranch, obviously, and the woman who uh, does all the training has a bunch of chaps that she let us borrow, one of which are being loaned to me, and they're very, very big, and um, they, my thought, I have that really weird pair thing going on that you see some women have, God bless them all, but like where it's, you're skinny on top and then something just went wrong from the waist <laughs> down, and that's what's occurring with these chaps on my body. So what we rigged um, nice. was, yeah, uh, was ass clamps to hold the backs of my thigh, the thighs of my chaps together. So I look a little, you know, a little more sexy, a little more femme, yeah. a little less thunder thigh-ish. But so in all the shots you'll see, some of them we couldn't do it. But in some, but in the shots you'll see from front on, it's they're hidden. But just know that there's some serious uh, Edward Scissorhands going on on the backs of my thighs. For some of the shots. Just some of them. Just some. Of them. No, actually, all of them. Well, all of the ones in which you're pretty much all of them. Then I'm wearing them. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty fantastic. You should keep your eye out and see if you uh, <laughs> can find them, but the fine editing people and costume design people right, have hidden them very well. Yeah, and so if you I'm are doing it. that, you have a lot of time on your hands. <laughs> If you're going through and looking for editing, but things, we're not judging. We're no not, judging. We're not and judging. We're, no, at all. and we're so happy you're watching this right now. But and you yeah, should probably watch it again next month. Just watch and it for the, the laughs that. and for the sexy ladies. But don't look for my ass clamps. No, I would prefer if you didn't do that. And on that point, <laughs> <laughs> thanks for joining us and cowgirl up, hey, cowgirl up, hey.